Today I'm going to be doing a tutorial right now, which I'm going to probably pause this and I'm doing a tutorial. This is just as a part three of the Photoshop painting tutorial of a female. So as you can see, I've already finished a body the bikini. So now I'm going to be doing the hair and maybe finish up like the hair of the body and the eyes and the, the skin, everything. So right now I'm going to... As you can see, I'm painting the strokes with a light, with a very, very light brush and a light yellowish brush itself to get out the general textures of, of to get out the general painting effects of the hair. So that's what I'm kind of doing right now to get out the general painting effects. And Just drawing out the general lines with a, with a very with a very very light yellowish color to get the the shading and the the shading the proper lighting effect of the hair. And I'm starting to get into the eyebrows and I'm starting to get into the eyes. And I apply a darker shade color to the hair to represent the shading effect of the hair. And then I take a light brown color to, to represent the streaks of the hair, to get the proper streaks properly of the hair. The hair particle st strands, the small little hair particle strands. And... And I start working on the very top layer right here of the hair. Getting at getting at the small foundation of the hair itself. And then I start going over it with a lighter base hair color. Actually I decided to erase that. Do white color. And then I start getting out the pink of the hair itself. Getting out the orange color of the hair. Getting out the red, the red nail polish on the hands. Then the feet, I would say. And 
And then I start doing the, the, the access erasing parts of the fingernails. Which I'm right now doing the erasing part so far right now. So I'm doing the erasing of the actual fingernails and all the other parts of the, the, the body. And then I've started to do the shadowing of the, the, the body itself. So I'm starting getting into the shading of the lips and getting in, trying to shade the lips properly on this character. getting in a dark contour of the lines of the shading and starting to focus on a light source of the lips, which is a light, the light reflecting. And now I'm going to start focusing on the eyes. Getting the small shading parts of the eyes pretty much. Getting the dark contour shading lines. And then I hit the mask tool and mask out the entire area where I'm going to where I'm going to get the entire line of the eyes done. And then I and then I actually start masking that out. And then I start masking out the, the inner section of the, the eyes. And start working on the shading of the eyes. Start working on the dark contours of the shading of the eyes. 
getting out the light source, getting out all of the stuff. So I used a hard airbrush to airbrush this entire character and I think now what I'm going to start working on is next is a pink the pink substance that's gonna it's that's in the middle of the, the edge of the, the eye itself I'm gonna work on next I think. Or I'm actually I'm actually working on the actual fingernails so far right now. And now I'm working on the light source of the actual fingernails. And as you can see, and I think the next thing I'm going to start working on is a cloth of this character. So I'm going to start working on a cloth. So as you can see, I'm doing basically the actual um, blue shadowing and blue, blue, the blue bait, adding the blue color to the sheets or so to the bed sheets and going to do some of the erasing of the character itself. And I'm just readjusting, finding the right layer where I would select. And so I would select each highlighted mask to get out the, the general mass of the character. So that's what I would do. So as I do that, I get out the general bed sheet texturing and I get rid of the mass itself in general. And and I'm just designing the character itself.
I'm actually designing the shading of the actual character. So I, I would get the, sh the general shading, draw out the general lines of the actual characters, the actual sheets. So I'm just get just refining the sheets up to make it more perfectly smooth and, and even. So that's what I'm doing. And I'm erasing all the lines of the, 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 I'm erasing all, I'm erasing the access blue that I don't need. So this is what I'm doing is erasing the access blue that I don't need. And I'm basically probably now going to sign my name since I'm finished. Date it. And just tr gonna try. So I guess I'm done the video. Guess I'm done. So that's so far what I've did so far. And that's it. We're done. So I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Sorry, oops, I dropped something. I hope you enjoyed this video tutorial. Please subscribe. Give me likes. And if 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 you have any questions, please comment. But this is this is so far the completed tutorial of this. The next tutorial I'm gonna be working on is gonna be the next open canvas tutorial. So I guess I'm done. So this is the end of this this entire tutorial in general. This is the very first Photoshop painting tutorial I did so far. So give me likes and please subscribe. I hope you can enjoy and I hope I can help you out a whole lot. Thank you, goodbye, and have a nice day.